Hello, so in today's class, we will uh, look at few more problems on hyperbola. So the first problem is uh, to find the equation of the hyperbola whose focus is 1 minus 1, uh, eccentricity is root 3 and the equation of the directrix is 3x plus 4y equal to 1. So you are given the uh, focus, eccentricity is given and the directrix is given. Now using these uh, three, uh, you need to find the equation of the ellipse. So let me call uh, the point, uh, focus to be the point S. So S11 uh, denotes the focus and let me take P of XY to be a point on the hyperbola. In a, uh, we know that uh, if uh, you have a point P on uh, the hyperbola, then uh, hyperbola, uh, form po, we have seen this equation SB by uh, PM will be equal to the eccentricity. So if uh, you have hyperbola and uh, you have the directrix, so this is the point S and if this is the point P, then the uh, distance at combo. So take the perpendicular distance SP. Um, so take the distance from S to P and the perpendicular distance. So this point will be M. So SP, SP by PM will be equal to the eccentricity. For S namakariyam, P in the coordinate XY aana. That will give you the distance of SP. PM, uh, you need to find the perpendicular distance from the point XY to the line. Uh, 3x plus 4y equal to 1. So, uh, if you have a line uh, ax plus by uh, plus c equal to 0, if you have need to find the perpendicular distance to a point xy, then the perpendicular distance will be given by ax plus by plus c by root of a square plus b square. So, this will give us the uh, distance pm. So, we have sp and pm and eccentricity is known to us. So, from this uh, result, we will get the uh, equation of the hyperbola. So, uh, from P, uh, draw the perpendicular PM to the directrix. Then, length of PM will be 3x plus 4y minus 1. So, here A and B are uh, 3 and 4 respectively. So, you will get root of uh, 3 square plus 4 square. So, that will be root of 25, 5 verum. So, the distance PM will be 3x plus 4y minus 1 by 5. Now, uh, by the definition of hyperbola, SP by PM and the E. Aana. So, uh, you will get SP equal to uh, E PM. Now, uh, S has coordinates 1 and minus 1 and P has coordinates XY. So, therefore, uh, the distance between SP will be root of uh, x minus 1 whole square plus y plus 1 whole square verum and that will be equal to root 3 times pm so which is 3x plus 4y minus 1 by 5. Now let us square on both sides so you will get x minus 1 whole square plus y plus 1 whole square equal to 3 by 25 3x plus 4y minus 1 whole square. Now Simplify jaya. So, open all the brackets and uh, so upon simplifying, uh, you are going to get 2x square minus 23y square plus 72xy plus 32x minus 74y minus 47 equal to 0. So, this is the equation of the required hyperbola. Uh, now, the second problem is to find the equation of the hyperbola uh, of given transverse axis whose vertex bisects the distance between uh, the center and the focus. Okay. For here, uh, let us look at the uh, figure. Okay. So, here uh, you are given the hyperbola so the center is c 
and uh, this is the vertex a is the vertex and s is the foci ini nammal eduthu parannirikkunnadana find the equation of the hyperbola of given transverse axis whose vertex bisects the distance between uh, the center and focus so we need to find the equation of hyperbola such that this vertex is so you have a line segment which is joining your center and foci for cs nu parayna line segment ine ee a nu parayna point bisect cheyina pole namaku equation the hyperbola kandupidikanam so here a that means a vertex a will be the uh, midpoint of the line cs so where c is a center and uh, s is the Uh, focus of the hyperbola ne uh, let us consider the standard yeah. equation of the hyperbola that means we we'll take the hyperbola which is centered at the origin and um, it vertex and the vary another so it the origin where vertex a zero ne uh, if e is eccentricity a will be equal to zero okay so uh, here for the speciality of these three points is such that uh, a0 is a midpoint of 0 0 and a0 okay uh, so uh, therefore now let us uh, write the equation of this hyperbola so standard equation of the hyperbola is x square minus x square by a square minus y square by b square equal to 1 in the transverse axis nu parayna ee hyperbola ke x axis aayikum varunna so that will be the transverse axis nu parayma that will be a a dash that will be on the x axis me here we have taken the center to be 0 0 then vertex as a 0 and uh, s that is a focus focus to be a 0 me we are given that the vertex will bisect uh, the distance between center and the focus so therefore vertex nu parayna midpoint of the line joining uh, center and focus are so, the line joining center and focus so therefore now applying the midpoint formula for midpoint in the coordinates nu parayna that will be uh, 0 plus ae by uh, 2 and 0 plus 0 by Two. So, if you have two points a one b one and uh, a two b two, then the coordinates of the midpoint in joining uh, midpoint of the line joining these two points will be a one plus a two by two and b one plus b two by two. So, uh, using that, you will get a equal to uh, a e plus zero by two arm. So that means two times a will be equal to a e. so which gives uh, e value uh, as 2 ne once uh, e is 2 uh, we know the formula for eccentricity for hyperbola e square will be a square plus b square by a square so uh, that will give 4 equal to 1 plus b square by a square so you will get b square by a square equal to 3 so which gives b square equal to 3 a square now substituting back b square in the equation of the hyperbola so you will get x square by a square minus y square by 3a square equal to 1 uh, now uh, that will give 3x square minus y square equal to 3a square so this is uh, the equation of a hyperbola where the vertex is bisecting the distance between the center and the focus so this is a required equation and the next problem is in a rectangular hyperbola prove that uh, sp into sp dash uh, is equal to cp square so now uh, let us consider so let us start with the hyperbola x square minus y square equal to a square so again for this the center is the origin okay this is centered at the origin karnam it is in the form x square by a square minus y square by a square equal to 1 so it is centered at the origin now for this hyperbola a square is equal to b square so eccentricity is given by uh, a square plus a square by a square where so which is equal to 2 so uh, the eccentricity will be 
ടു ഫോർ ദസ് ഹൈപ്പോള ഇനി നമുക്ക് വേണ്ട എന്താണ് എസ് വേണം പി ദിസ് ഇസ് എസ് ഡാഷ് പി സോറി ദിസ് ഇസ് എസ് ഡാഷ് പി സോ എസ് പി ഇൻറ്റു എസ് ഡാഷ് പി ഇസ് ഈക്വൽ ടു സി പി സ്ക്വയർ സോ എസ് ആൻഡ് എസ് ഡാഷ് ഡിനോട്ട്സ് ദി പോസൈ സോ ദിസ് ഇസ് എസ് ആൻഡ് ഇയർ യു ഹാവ് എസ് ഡാഷ് ആൻഡ് സി ഡിനോട്ട്സ് ദി സെൻ്റർ ആൻഡ് P is any point on the hyperbola. So we need to show that SP uh, into uh, S dash P E and the distance name product in the right now CP square on the particle. So CP is the uh, distance between uh, the center and the point XY. So this is the point XY. Now we have S in name S dash name coordinates are under the right now. Okay. So we have to എസിന്റെ കോർഡിനേറ്റ്സ് എന്ന് പറയുന്നത് എ ഇ സീറോയും ആൻഡ് കോർഡിനേറ്റ്സ് ഓഫ് എസ് ഡാഷ് വിൽ ബി മൈനസ് എ ഇ സീറോ സോ വി ഹാവ് ഗോട്ട് ഇ ഈസ് റൂട്ട് ടു സോ ദർ ഫോർ കോർഡിനേറ്റ്സ് ഓഫ് എസ് വിൽ ബി റൂട്ട് ടു എ സീറോ ആൻഡ് കോർഡിനേറ്റ്സ് ഓഫ് എസ് ഡാഷ് ഇസ് മൈനസ് റൂട്ട് ടു എ സീറോ സോ എസ് ആൻഡ് എസ് ഡാഷ് ആർ ദി ഫോർ സൈ നൗ ലെറ്റ് എസ് ടേക്ക് P to be a point on the hyperbola. P of x y to be a point on the hyperbola. And uh, I'll now uh, write the distances S p square and uh, S dash p square. For S p no arena that is uh, the distance between S and P that will be uh, S p square you will get x minus root 2 a whole square plus y square over m. And S dash P at the same time, X plus, S dash P whole square at the same time, X plus root 2A whole square plus Y square. And again, C P square will be the distance of the line joining X, Y and 0, 0. So, the distance will be X square plus Y square. Now, let us take the product of S P square and S dash P square. From then and simplify jay the video I have opened the bracket so you will get x square plus 2a square plus y square minus 2 root to ax verum ibida x square plus 2a square plus y square plus 2 root to ax so this can be put in the form a minus b into a plus b form in amu kere dhaam vittu so that will be equal to a square minus b square so this will give x square plus y square plus 2a square whole square minus need in the square 2 root 2 in the square 8 to verum so 8 a square x square now open this first term so take the expansion of this so you will get x raised to 4 plus y raised to 4, 4 a raised to 4, then 2 x square y square, then 4 x square a square, uh, plus 4 uh, y square a square, then minus 8 a square x square. Apo 4 a square x square cancel out, minus 4 a square x square. Verum. And now uh, we have x raised to 4 plus y raised to 4, here under term. 2x square y square in the term goody combine jamba you will get x square plus y square whole square verum nee namakku baakki ulladu 4a raised to 4 under then this is i can write it as minus 4a square into x square minus y square nee x square minus y square in the array in the a square on it so because we started with the rectangular hyperbola x square minus y square equal to a square so this is a square so you are going to get minus 4 a raised to 4 plus 4 a raised to 4 so this will cancel out and you are going to get x square plus y square whole square we have already gone to x square plus y square in our another cp square on it so you will get cp square whole square so that gives sp square into s dash p square equal to cp square whole square now taking the square root on both sides, so you will get sp uh, into s dash p equal to cp square. So that is the uh, proof of the.
ಮಿಸ್ ಆಯ್ತು